Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. In this video, I want to show you another demo example how you may use our 10 watt uh, deluxe laser and what actually you can cut and engrave. So we um, slightly modified it. We use our air nozzle version 2 with G2 lens. Now we are going to cut uh, 3.2 millimeter plywood. Um, let me show you. So this is 3.2 millimeter and the density is 0 0.7 grams on one cubical centimeter. Uh, okay, we have our magnet. We're gonna put it here. And um, yes, let's cut it. The speed is uh, 150 millimeters per minute. So um, it should be done quite easily we made a few different experiments before as you can see <laughs> but um, yeah probably the speed could be good at 175 as well but uh, we just want to make sure that was cut quite accurately and clean here yeah. and can be easily removed Another cutting experiment, we take 3.7 millimeter plywood. Focus it, 3.7, the same density. And for this one, we're going to use a little bit lower speed. Let's uh, do 75. As you can see, we have an air compressor here. We use Halia air compressor with capacity, um, you need at least 60 or 70 liters per uh, minute. And uh, like I said, G2 lens and air nozzle uh, version 2 from Endurance. And the whole installation, you see, it's our uh, CNC 30 machine. Not, not our, but uh, it's quite common CNC 30, 18 uh, CNC frame and we use software GRBL control. I'll show you a bit later. Okay. Ready to explore the result. Okay, so you see that was cut quite well. So that's it for cutting. And now let's do some engraving tests. So we have a stainless steel. We previously engraved using our 10 watt DPSS laser model. And this one was also done with 10 watt DPSS. But let's see what diode can actually do. So the speed is uh, 100. 100 and uh, let's, let's engrave and see the result. We're using air compressor, so you, we can actually turn it off, but uh, you can do it with the air compressor. Doesn't really matter. So you get more oxygen, and engraving is like oxidation process. So, oops, I think I missed it a little bit, but not a big deal, I hope. Okay. So, do you see the result? Yeah, actually, all three results are quite different. Or two. So this is, this is like more brown. This is like more gray. And the last uh, engraving sample I want to show you is titanium. This was also made using our DPSS. As you can see, different colors can be achieved on titanium. I like this metal. And uh, yeah, let's uh, do the same speed. Uh, also air compressor. Yeah, probably in the middle I can turn off air compressor and we'll see the result. 
remain the same. Okay. Yeah, so you can actually engrave on titanium without any paste. Compressor. Okay. So, yeah, so you see, it's quite nice. So, yeah, you can actually engrave on titanium without any paste and uh, at a decent speed. So, uh, yeah, that was our quick uh, laser uh, engraving and cutting tests using our 10 watt. Uh, deluxe uh, laser model so hope that you like this video please share it with your friends and we'll do some more experiments by adding different engraving paste and engraving on aluminum copper brass and some other materials including steel so stay tuned with endurance and have wonderful experiment experience with us and don't forget to visit our website endurancelasers.com and our online store endurance-lasers.com. Bye-bye.